So I set the hammock up with the, the tarp just to see how like it looks. Uh, see if I can get some decent coverage. And it seems to work okay. Uh, the tarp's big enough. I've just strung it out. Uh, pretty basic, but seems to work fine. Could do with more this way, I think, but it uh, doesn't matter. But yeah, it's good to be set up. So it's Sunday morning and I'm lying under my tarp on my hammock just chilling I just want to see what sort of coverage I would get with a 3x3 three three metre tarp and it seems pretty good could probably do we moving the tap further that way a wee bit but as it's not going to rain what's the point so I think you could get used to this it would be for me personally it would be a summer thing uh, I don't know if I, I mean I don't camp in the winter anyway anymore, so I find that kind of boring, those long nights, sort of a past that, carry on, leave that to the younger ones now, but I think this would be great in the summer, summer months this would be fantastic, maybe beside a lock or Doing a bit of fishing would be fantastic doing this. Uh, very, very comfortable. And I think I'll make a lightweight version with the same materials as the tarp. Because this is, this is okay for taking down the woods and hanging about on it, but it's excessive weight. You don't really need all that weight. So. Yeah, a lightweight version would be good. Uh, just to take away the bike, string it up somewhere and do a bit of fishing. Uh, or even just use it for your shelter at night if you're on a bike trip. And it would be fantastic that wee bug thing in there with the dog whining in the background. But it's an old dog and it wanes. That's what old dogs do. Yeah, it's very relaxing just chilling here. So I think that tarp is a big enough tarp for keeping you dry. I mean, it's, there's a wee breeze, I've strung out that middle one there, on a, a branch of a tree. The, the breeze is coming this way. Uh, but yeah. I could see me liking this in the summertime. I wouldn't do it in the winter. Uh, that's a die-hard thing, that. It's bad enough camping at the end in the winter, never mind. I don't think I'd like to camp in the hammock in the winter, but that's just my preference. I'm sure there's lots of out there who love it. But yeah, I'd like it in the summer. It'd be great. Great wee, you could have a great wee camp set up here.
could even take this heavyweight uh, this heavyweight one and I've got a heavyweight tarp it's not as wide as this tarp it's only I think it's 2 metres wide 3 metres by 2 metres but that way if you took them these are flame proof this is flame proof material the hammock is made out of and so is the, the heavyweight tarp so you could have a fire underneath your tarp and the sparks when they burn it around so that'd be handy that'd be a handy idea but like I say they'd be heavy tarp, this tarp weighs about 2 kilos the tarp weighs about 2 kilos you'd be taking about 4 kilos with you but if you're not going that far and it's, you're only going away for a night or two it's not a big weight to carry. Uh, it's only an extra couple of kilos, you know. So, just chilling, lying here, all comfy, and liking it. <laughs>